This is a tragedy on many levels. My heartfelt sympathy is extended to the infant's family, and my thoughts will remain with every person who will be forever impacted by this event. Tonight, a woman is charged with killing her nine-month-old son. Shelly Bortz is live in Indiana County showing us what police say happened. Shelly. Yeah, 21-year-old Patricia Hollenbaugh is behind bars here without bail, accused of the unimaginable. Police say she smothered her nine-month-old son, then staged the scene to make it look like an accident. The only charges that will stem from this incident are the ones that were already filed. Indiana Borough Police Chief Justin Shaw didn't mince words when he stood before reporters today and said the right person, the only person responsible for this horrific crime, Patricia Hollenbaugh, is behind bars. Every confidence. Shaw says on January 6th, his department was called here to this apartment on Regency Square Drive in Indiana Borough for reports of an unresponsive child. When officers arrived, the nine-month-old baby had no pulse and wasn't breathing. He was immediately taken to Children's Hospital, where he died five days later. Since that initial call, members of the Indiana Borough Police conducted a professional and thorough investigation with the goal of finding the truth. During that investigation, police say Hollenbaugh initially told them she put her son down for a nap in his crib. And when she checked on him an hour later, he was hanging partially outside the crib with his face down on the mattress. Police conducted multiple interviews and reenactments with the baby's parents on just how he was found, at which Hollenbaugh repeatedly changed her story. After pressing Hollenbaugh further about the discrepancies, they say she finally admitted to smothering the infant by applying pressure to his head and face area with a blanket until he stopped breathing. Then police say Hollenbaugh stated she panicked and placed the baby between the slats of the crib to cover up what she did. The Indiana Borough Police found sufficient evidence to support the filing of charges. At the time of the preliminary hearing, the Commonwealth will be prepared to fully present the evidence necessary for those proceedings. Manzi adds this investigation is far from over and asks anyone who have had who has had contact with Hollenbaugh over the past few months to reach out to police. He says any statements she made or behaviors you witnessed may be very important to this case. Now Hollenbaugh is scheduled to be in court on February 8th for her preliminary hearing. Reporting live outside of Indiana County Jail, Shelley Boards, KDKA TV News. Thank you, Shelley.